This is a film about a great lady of soul by a great soulful lady. Uh, there is not a filmmaker, uh, documentary filmmaker anyways, and probably any filmmaker I know who doesn't take inspiration from the incredible career of Barbara Koppel. Earlier today, uh, it was part of Doc NYC, we did uh, what we call our Visionaries Tribute Award, where Barbara Koppel was one of the recipients of a Lifetime Achievement Award. When I polled the documentary community uh, earlier this year to, uh, to, to ask who they thought that we should honor, uh, Barbara Koppel was the very top name of uh, of anyone that uh, that that we got answers for. It's probably a, a universal uh, acclaim. You can just see the love that she gets out of uh, out of the films, out of the people that she's filmed. Um, uh, Andrew Drecke, who made the uh, the series The Jinx, uh, once said to me that when he was starting out, he was making his first film, Capturing the Freedmen's. Uh, he talked to two filmmakers, and uh, the first filmmaker said. Documentary film, it's such a funny business. Like, you meet these people and then you never see them again. You film them, you never see them again. And then Andrew went and he talked to Barbara Koppel and she said, documentary film, it's such a funny bi business. You meet these people and they become part of your lives forever. <laughs> you can see that in the film. You know, the, the, the characters that Barbara puts on screen become parts of our lives forever. It's my great privilege to welcome Miss Barbara Koppel. It's my amazing pleasure to be here and to have this room filled with people that I love, with Sharon Jones and the Dap Kings, with the people who made this film, Dave Cassidy, Gene Chan, Luke, everybody, and Frado, and you're gonna meet them all at the end of the film. This has been one of the great experiences of my life, and I will never forget it. And thank you, Sharon Jones and the Dap Kings, for putting up with us. Here it is, Miss Sharon Jones. Well, the film just is like a little part of my life, but it was such a big part with the cancer. And it's back, and I'm still dealing with it now. But, yeah, the, the movie, I'm, every time I watch it, it's like... It's so surreal sometimes. It just seems like uh, I'm dreaming when I sit up and look at myself on the film. But I'm really grateful, and it, and it told a great story, Barbara. Thank you all for catching that. Oh, it's you, I, baby. Yeah, you know, you caught that out of me, even though you're like, oh, I'm scared in my face. But I'm so, <laughs> now, now I'm so sad that I complain. <laughs> Hi, my name is John Castellano. And Sharon Jones sang with me for 18 years in the band Good and Plenty. Uh, I also brought Star and Sharon and Sandra all together, and they sang. We had an unbelievable group, and she took it to the lot next level. Before I say anything else, uh, please, a big round of applause for the Dap Kings, because they're an excellent band. And, and Barbara Koppel, you got to show the funny side of Sharon. So hard and funny, and a big heart. So I'm glad you captured that. So now the world can see what a real star is like. Yeah. Dave Guy, trumpet player, Dap Kings. Mm. Uh, it's, yeah, all that. <laughs> you know, it's so intense watching that stuff because when you're in, when it's happening, you don't think about it. And to look at it as like, it's just really emotional. But I miss you and I love you. And Barbara, it was an amazing movie. And I'm just, yeah, yeah, I got you, yeah. <laughs> and I'm just so thrilled to be here, and thank you. I'm Neil, saxophone player, and um, thank you, Barbara, for documenting what we've been doing for a long time and will hopefully continue to do for a lot longer. But just hearing the band and Sharon, I think the music just, it, you know, it sings over this movie, and uh, it, it feels so great to be part of it, and looking and seeing all these guys that I've been traveling with for the last 20 years now, and, um, and hearing it sound so good, and seeing these people and the relationship that we all have together, that it just, it, it is amazing. It's, it's weird that you have to step back from it and look at it to realize what you have. 
when we're out here performing and everybody's doing our thing, for me, it's about the people and the connection and the love and encouraging everybody and making this world a better place. And I'll just say, Sharon, watching you sing in the wedding bands from back in the day, you were always larger than life then. And seeing you up there was like 10,000 and a thousand more times bigger and more beautiful. And I'm just so glad you're here and I love you. And thank you, everybody. Hi, my name is Binky Griptite. Uh, I'm a guitar player and an MC in the Dap Kings. And I'm the person that gets to say, Miss Sharon Jones for a living. Uh, you did such a great job with yeah. it. Because, you know, when we first met you, we were just like, Oscar winner? This lady? No, we're just kidding. No. No, you, we didn't know who you were before, but we know now. Right. Hi, my name is Ray Novoselsky. I was consulting producer on this. Sharon, the way you faced what you did was so inspiring. And thank you for letting Barbara and the team in on that. Because I, I think because you did, there's going to be a lot of people who are going through what you went through who are going to be, who are going to gain a lot of power from, from what you did. So thank you. That was the whole idea. Thank you. I'm Jean Chan, I'm the editor. Sharon, you're my inspiration. Um, I have the privilege of watching all every frame of 300 hours, and and I have to say, the first hour I was in my mom's basement, I cried because my father lost the battle to bile duct cancer. I hope you healthy. Lots, of, I'm <laughs> just inspiration. Thank you, and thank you, Barbara. So I'm Dave Cassidy, and I'm going to take this moment because today was a special day. Barbara was honored by Doc NYC, and this crew here, this is a collaboration, and I have this honor to say, 14 years ago I came to New York, and I said to myself, I wanna work with one person, I was Barbara Koppel, and I stand on the stage and I get to share it with my idol, my mentor, my friend, and I have never been ashamed to have my name at the end of a single film I've made, and every day I go to work and I believe that the next thing that I make with Barbara is gonna be the best thing that we have made, and I don't know very many people in this business that can say that, but on a special day, Thank I have you. to say I love you. And we all are so honored to share this stage with you. Thank you. Every moment, every second um, I got to spend with Sharon was special. She taught me so much about life, about living, about persevering, about having an attitude that was so incredible. When she was having chemo, everybody else was sort of sitting there and Sharon was laughing and talking and singing and she brought me into a world of all of these fantastic people who I will never, never forget and hope I'm always part of your life and will always come to see you whenever I can, performing and the friendships. Watch your films. Well, you better. <laughs> well, I'm going to take you all out with that song y'all saw me sing in church. And I sing because I'm happy. And I sing because I'm free. I know God watches, he watches over me.